what I'm saying? At D A W R A P P E R on Instagram. I'm the owner of Perfect Kennels. I established the company in 2015. We just strive to just try to make the perfect companion, even though no dog is ever perfect. You know what I'm saying? We at least strive for perfection. Our, our slogan, our motto is if it ain't perfect, then it just ain't worth it. I was actually blessed coming into the dog business, you know what I mean? I bought my first dog, like, I think it was like 12 racks, Fifi. He had to get a flu in from Puerto Rico. Shout out to uh, HQ Bullies, you know what I'm saying, out of Puerto Rico, Miami. My boy Rico Supreme out of the Bay. I seen his dog, and he had Dollar. So when I seen Dollar as a pup, I'm like, oh, man, he was just... He was just one of them puppies, bro. You know, I would come over and visit, you know what I'm saying, just to, you know, come feed Dollar and play with Dollar as a pup. I'm like, man, I kind of want a dog now, man. So he turned me on the uh, HQ Bully page, ended up finding me a lolly, went with Fiance, and she was just a ball of joy, just a little, a little witty little dog growing up. And my dad, but when I first got her, he fell in love with her. He really wanted, he really wanted fiance for himself. So that's how I ended up, you know what I'm saying? This was one of her first pups. So that's how I ended up doing that. Coming in, um, I was around, I think it's a game at the time. Lucci's booking agent was a red agency. So Chip ended up, you know, coming through, seeing the first letter. He picked the first boy that looks exactly like Dollar, you know what I'm saying, a black try. So he got Kodak. Man, it was a great experience, man, you know. Um, I've known him for a long time. Um, he treats his dogs real good. And I think that's the most important thing, is having a dog that's been treated right. He's a great foundation dog. I think he has the perfect structure. Um, the true form, um, formality of uh, what a bully is. I guess he got a nice chest, uh, nice size. He looks identical to his dad. So he did give me my first litter, so, which gave me another good foundation dog. Yeah, he's helped a lot. I, tr I trust the dog with any newborn, any two-year-old, one-year-old, six-month-year-old. Six Never had any issues. Just, you know, how you treat your dog. He showed Lucci the pictures of the pups, and he said he wanted a blue one. And so, boom, he come through. I go meet him, show him the boy. He like, oh man, he like, yeah, he hard, I'm fucking with him. So I had another little lilac one in my hand, you know what I'm saying? And long story short, he ended up just buying both of them. Like, shout out to my friend Lucha, you know what I mean? Good business, you feel me? So, my last little, I had a little uh, last year where I actually ran my boy right here dirty, you know what I'm saying, to uh, fiance. So I said, it's rapper Guap Music Entertainment. I said, him a, a chocolate try off of this guy, you know what I'm saying? I had another chocolate one left though. So he ended up hitting me like, man, 21 seen the dog on Instagram. He said he want one. So I'm like, you know what I'm 21, 21? He's like, yeah, like savage. So I'm like, well, you know, tell him I got him one, you know what I'm saying? So you know, he was on tour, had a lot of things going on at the time. So he ended up sending one of his real good friends, you know what I mean? Boom, cashed out, dogs on the plane. Headed to Hollywood somewhere for living his best life, you know what I'm saying? Right now, um, both of his sisters, you know what I'm saying, just dropped a little, got itty bitty. She ended up giving me only like two of them, you know what I'm saying? And then Fupa, you know what I'm saying? A real little short one, real short, stocky, micro, you know what I'm saying? She ended up dropping nine, you know, one died at birth. So I got an eight piece out there, you know what I mean? So I got like 10 puppies right now. So it kind of crazy how it picked up. You know, it, it took a minute, you know what I'm saying? But just being that I was able to, you know what I'm saying, sell a, you know, a celebrity 
a dog off my first little, it kind of brought a lot of awareness to my program and, you know, how my dogs was looking and, you know, people could kind of just follow and see how their dog grew up and how it looked. Did it get all tall? You know what I'm saying? Whatever your preference is as far as the dogs, you know what I mean? But, yeah, they, they you know, everything is everything's just, just perfection over here, perfect kennels, man. I mean, we really stand behind that. I've had dogs before, um, but I've never had a dog that was as smart as he is, or as like, I don't know, like I've had dogs, but you know how they say like dogs is a man's best friend and like companionship, but like this is like the real definition of companionship out of like the dogs that I've had. Well for one, he's a, a protector, I call him security for short. Um, also he like, he kind of feeds off of my emotions. So, you know, like if there's something wrong, he can kind of sense that. And he has like his own kind of personality. It's almost, it's like having a little broke best friend. It was a good experience. So the dogs come healthy, all ready, ready to go, pre-registered and everything else. So it was a pretty easy process. I don't do like the norm with him only because like he's, he's like an investment also. So I just try to keep him out of harm's way at all. like in all possible ways. He's a very friendly dog. His, uh, his structure is kind of intimidating, but he's very sweet. He's like just a big baby. We got good foundation pups, man, you feel me? Like $5,000, like it's basically a small business, you know what I'm saying? Depends on how you look at it, you feel me? We also do companions, of course, you know what I'm saying? This is my boy, uh, this is my dad dog, I actually. Gave this dog to my dad here. Go by the name of Dirty Hair. You know what I'm saying? Chocolate Try. Boys are straight up stud. You know what I mean? Bone. No muzzle. You know what I'm saying? Girth. Boys just a straight up tank, man. You know what I mean? By like 55 pounds, something like that. You know what I mean? But uh, he only maybe like, uh, they like 13. Maybe like 13 inches tall or something like that. Right now we're in the process of building a uh, an indoor kennel, 12, maybe 15 stalls, like a dog heaven. And we're going indoor, AC, heat. Dogs will have their own personal little condo, you know what I'm saying, be able to come out on the balcony and, you know what I'm saying, just see what's going on and go back into their domicile, you know what I mean? Like I say, heat, air condition, uh, I think I'm going AstroTurf, electric balls, you know what I mean? Just I'm gonna try to just go all out, man. Make the perfect kennels, uh, indoor kennel, man. We gotta have it, gotta have it right, man. Something like a Disney World for dogs or something, you know what I mean? But yeah, other than that, we got um, like I said, we got the Merle. You know what I'm saying? Came out of Hawaii. I've been watching uh, Okalani. You know what I mean? I've been watching their program for a minute. They also got pretty boy blood. We, we go the extra mile, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna be there basically throughout the process, you know, if you, at any time, you need me to pull up and, you know, something going on with the dog or anything, whatever it is, you know. We gonna call 24 hours. We gonna jump up out the bed, you know what I mean, to come, you know what I mean, stand behind our product, you know what I mean? Stand behind our dogs, cause, I mean, they're beautiful. And remember, if it ain't perfect, then it ain't worth it.